So in mid-July of 1954, Roy walks up to the bus station, which is a block and a half up, and meets his brother, J.R. And they came, they came directly to me. And uh, they walked right up to me, and Roy said, Marshall, this is my brother, J.R., Marshall Grant. We shook hands. And he said, I hear you pick a little bit. I said, very little. And he said, me too. <laughs> and so we uh, talked a little bit and went over on the other side of the shop and met Luther. First thing you knew, we were getting together, and we were all three playing rhythm guitars. That's all. So we were having a lot of fun, and about this time, Elvis Presley got started. But that's all right, Sweet Mama, his first record there, and they were playing it around over town, and we decided that's what we wanted to do. And so I said, well, guys, if we're going to try to get on record, we can't go up there and play it all three playing rhythm guitars. <laughs> so we need to do a little changing up here. Luther said, I know where I can borrow an electric guitar. And uh, so he went up to, to uh, OK Hawk Music up on Union Avenue, borrowed this uh, Fender guitar, and he came back down. He said, you know, Marshall, they've got a big old upright bass up there. And uh, I said, well, I'll go up and see. So I went up, and I bought this thing for $25. It was all beat up and everything, and come back and bought it at the house. And we didn't know how to tune it. I called JR and I said, JR, let's get over together over my house tonight. We're going to tune this bass. <laughs> so he said, All right, I'll be there. So he and Vivian came over and he said, Marshall, if you're going to play the bass, can I borrow your guitar? I said, Sure. This guitar. And so I said, Sure, you can. And so he started playing this guitar. And I was playing the, I started playing the bass a little bit, and I, I looked at this thing, and I said, let's play something. They started a little rhythm pattern, and I started plumping the strings a little bit, plumping, and then I'd pump and slap it, pump it and slap it. This is the only way I knew to keep time with them. I'd pump the, hit a string and slap it, hit the string and slap it. And John was working his awkward way on this guitar, and Luther doing that little thing that you heard on all those records. And there's so many people thinks that we spent 10 years creating this style. <laughs> I mean, it was there the first eight bars we played, <laughs> and we spent the next four years trying to get rid of it. 